Here you are then, Mum. I bought you another treat. Raspberry Royale. That's what you wanted, isn't it? They had Sherry Trifle too, but you turned your nose about that last time. Ah. We're going for the silent treatment, are we? Well, it's my birthday today. I didn't get your card. Second post, maybe. 39 today. I don't look it. Thank you very much. I use extremely expensive eye cream. It's guaranteed to cover the not quite as fertile as I used to be look that's creeping up under my eyes. Anyway, I'm meeting Matt later. Did I tell you about him? I don't think you'd approve. He's an acquired taste. And he's married. I fell right into that cliche. Very good in bed, though. You know, we get up to all sorts. Your mind, if you had one, it would boggle. Come on, tuck in. You can't let a good raspberry royale go to waste. Raspberry's fit for a queen. You're very quiet today. Now you haven't got your audience. But it's alright, because I know what you're thinking. Slugs leave trails, you see. Sweetness and light, my ass. You like to play dirty, don't you, Anne? I was a little girl. You were the one that turned it into a competition. I was just a little girl. But it doesn't matter now. He's dead. He's dead now. My dad's dead. I still dream about him, though. We're at Western Supermare and we're burying you in the sand. And we just leave you there. We go off together and we get ice cream. Neapolitan flavour because I can never choose. And then I wake up and I feel safe. And then I realise we've forgotten you and you're still there buried in the sand and I feel guilty for the rest of the day. Do you know what's so ironic though, Mum? What, what you don't get is I still want to help you. I'm here with my spade and I'm ready to dig. But you're not interested, are you? Just answer me one thing. Why does this feel like a punishment? You being ill and helpless. Tell me what I've done, come on. Well, you win.